Problem statement. Problem statement it is the description of an issue currently existing which needs to be addressed. It is usually one or two sentences to explain the problem your process improvement project or thesis will address. In general, a problem statement will outline the negative points of the current situation and explain why this matters. It also serves as a great communication tool, helping to get buying and support from others. Importance of problem statement A problem statement serves as a tool for communication. Harlem World magazine considers that the problem statements are crucial in the context of projects aimed at improving companies, individuals, and other organizations. A problem statement is important to a process improvement project because it helps clearly identify the goals of the project and outline the scope of a project. It also helps guide the activities and decisions of the people who are working on the project. Research problem versus problem statement. The research problem is an area of concern or a gap in existing knowledge that points to need for further understanding and investigation while problem statement is used in research work as a claim that outlines the problem addressed by a study. The research problem is limited to one or more pages while problem statement is limited to one or two sentences, usually. The sources of problem statement are classroom, school, community, lectures, internet, own teaching experience, supervisor, faculty members, class discussions, research reports, term papers, textbooks, seminars, workshops, paper presentations etc. While in problem statement there is no special knowledge required just you will shrink your research problem into one or two sentences. In many theses, I have observed that problem statement is same as research problem or research problem statement. The importance of research problem is that it is the first step and heart of research process is to identify the research problem while the importance of problem statement is that it is a part of research problem. The purpose of research problem statement to determine the objective and intention of the research. In the absence of an aim or objective you cannot determine the research methodology while the purpose of a problem statement is to introduce the importance of the topic in the research proposal, position the problem in an appropriate context and provide a framework to analyze and report results. In research problem, the author's citation in middle or end of paragraph is necessary while there is no need of author's citations in problem statement. In many universities, the synonyms of research problem is problem identification or problem statement or research problem statement while the synonym of problem statement is statement of problem. The research problem is the first step in research process while problem statement is not the first step in research process. The problem statement have separate three steps to write it clearly and effectively. The first step of problem statement is to contextualize the problem, the second step is to show why it matters and third step is to set your aims and objectives. The research problem can help us identify each and every step of the research process, the study design, sampling strategy, research instrument and research analysis while the problem statement can help us to ensure everyone working on a project knows what the problem they need to address is and why the project is important. The elements of research problems are five. Number one is the research problem should be clear and concise. Number two is the research problem should relate to one or more fields of study. Number three is the research problem should be feasible. Number four is a good problem is grounded in theory. Number five is good research problems have base in literature. The elements of problem statement are three. Number one is the problem itself, stated clearly and with enough contextual detail to establish why it is important. Number two is the method of solving problem. 
Number three is the purpose, statement of objectives and scope of the project being proposed. Research problem statement. Three required parts in part A. The actual research problem and its justification will be explained in paragraph one. In part B, the deficiency gap will elaborately explain based on past studies in in paragraph 2. In part C the method participants location and benefits will be explained in paragraph 3. Problem statement. Four required parts. Number one part is start with a general problem identifying the need for the study. Example is. The problem of this study is. Number two part is to state the specific problem proposed for research use citation and usually a number to make it clear to the reader example is. 30% of the farms have been affected by the Napier grass disease. Number three part is introductory words describing methodological approach such as research design are given and are appropriate to the specific proposal problem. Example is. This qualitative study will explore or this quantitative study will examine. Number one part is general population group of proposed study is identified. Small scale farmers in affected locations will be surveyed to determine. Kindly subscribe my YouTube channel Thesis Helper. Thanks for watching.